Good morning. Welcome to Dude RV. I really appreciate you stopping by. And of course, say it with me, you got here just in time. That's right. It's Friday, and it's time for another edition of Friday's Finds. If you've not ever watched an episode of Friday's Finds, this is all about stuff from Amazon. So we've got some some unboxing to do here, some some toys to play with, some tech, some some labor. Yeah, so we're just gonna open these packages right here. And we'll go from there. We're going to start off this brown envelope. This was a, a interesting thing to me. I've actually worked with a similar. This goes in a four and a half, four inch, a four inch hand grinder. It is a diamond blade. Ah, got tape on it. Stealth tape. There we go. So I need to pull out the, the hand grinder. This will cut tile, marble, PVC pipe, and color steel tile. Hmm. Right out of the box, it's missing the washer. Okay, I have to find Go digging somewhere and find my hand grinder. Next thing is these are these are of interest to me because I cook a whole I, I'm cooking on the barbecue a lot these days. These are Kevlar gloves for working on hot with hot stuff. Fingers are really long. We'll have to find something hot to handle. Too hot to handle. We'll see about that. Next thing. This one got me excited. This is this is cool. This comes to us from Telecian on Amazon. So who sent this to us? Oh, we do have this set. So the grinder blades were sent to us from Oprex. Oprex. These are Oprex. I don't know what happened to the slip for this one. So it's unknown. Maybe it says on here. Nope. Hand love. <laughs> hand love. Not too sure about that. Anyway, hand love. So Telesan has sent us a borescope. Check this out. Handy dandy little device. Does it take batteries? Nope, it has built-in battery. So I gotta I gotta charge it up. And then we'll go we'll go look at something. We'll go look inside something. And then Bowen Smart, Bowen Smart has sent us a watch. This is the sport watch. This is the Sunkita Sport Watch. Oh, very nice. Lots of different band options. Actually, three different band options. Oh, that's the the pin tool, and then we have the watch itself. I 
and I'm sure that's going to require some charging up. So let me read some instructions, get some electricity flowing, and we'll be back. So I have found that this this watch, this, I like this thing. It's pretty cool. You can go into the app. I've got a great app. You can change all the change the watch face. Lots of different options. You can make phone calls. Checks all your vital statistics. Shows you right there. Sleep, blood, oxygen, stress, emotional. Lots of data in here. There are different kinds of modes for different activities. So it's kind of hard to see here in the sun. Back over here. Skipping, swimming, badminton, table tennis, tennis, walking. Hey, go find a hand grinder. Let's see what this thing can do. Big, heavy, heavy piece. We're going to see if we can take a little corner off. It is definitely cutting. I guess a pretty dang good deal right there. You got to keep in mind, this is almost, almost half an inch thick. That's tough for just about any blade to cut. So we're doing, we're doing really good with that. Cement block. I like those. That's awesome. Yeah, you'll like it too. Look how clean that cut is. And there looks like there's still plenty of diamond material on it. I like it. Another box arrived. This is the Turbo B. 24 ounce clear plastic cups with sippy lids. 200 pack. That's a bunch of big cups. Let's take a look at what they are. Let's, let's see what they look like. Buy better, live easy. There's our lid. And there's our cup. This right handy there. A little sippy hole. We need a beverage. We will Meanwhile, we got to go see some more stuff So this little borescope camera, this is really neat Do the camera and a camera thing here. So you've actually got multiple options 
we can look around there's the TV if you want to flip it over you can change so if you're you're looking down in a place and you're upside down you can rotate this several different directions and if you need to see to the side there's a second camera so there's actually a, a side facing camera which is where that light is and then you go to the front camera and where there is no matter where you're trying to look you can change the orientation This is going to come in real, real handy. <laughs> there we go. Hey, this is this thing is really is really cool. Though, but if you stare at that light, it you'll you'll have a hard time seeing. But this is a really cool item. If you're looking for a good borescope, this one is definitely a value. All right, let's go. We gotta go. We gotta go check out some hot gloves. How how to demonstrate? How how to demonstrate these these hot gloves? It's 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 too hot for a campfire. So I thought, well, I do a lot of cooking, and I use this propane torch. Let's test it. Okay, so... No damage. Discolored it a little bit. It's definitely warm to the touch. So I guess now I have to really put it to the test. Let's, uh, I'll put on a glove and <laughs> hopefully, I don't, hopefully I don't cook my hand. You'll notice I'm wearing the, the watch. Really have been pleased with this watch. I have, have worn it for several days now. Got to get the fingers of these gloves stretched out. But I've worn this watch for several days working. And we were doing a major construction project here on the homestead. Uh, and I wore it throughout the process, sweating profusely. All right, we ready? So it's, it's kind of, it's warm. Starting to get hot. So I think these, these are definitely worthwhile. I don't know that I would use them for welding, but for handling charcoal and campfire type stuff working in the kitchen these are these are awesome good value so when they reached out to me about these cups i was like they're just plastic cups <laughs> yappy was really impressed with this now, now pretty much all we drink around here is water water and wine but this works great for Taking the beverage out on the patio. We don't have to worry about bugs getting in the wine. We're now filtering the water. Now that we have water here on the homestead. So we're going through lots of water. And I can take that out on the tractor. And not have to worry about breakage damage. So I think this is a pretty cool deal. You get your Starbucks latte to go. All right watch i like it it's a good one 
gloves they work like they're adver just as advertised they do work and the more scope that's a cool toy but it's more importantly it's a very handy tool i cannot tell you how many times i've dropped a wrench or something down into the engine compartment on trudy thunder and I, you know how do you find that well now we have a camera we can get down in there we can look behind the sofa if we drop something back there so a bore scope camera is a handy thing to have and that brings us to the end of this once again random edition of friday's finds i sure appreciate you stopping by post a comment down there and tell me what you like best on this edition of friday's finds and for those of you who have been following along we are we are making progress on on getting our life situated don't have any camping stuff schedule just yet kind of building a trip maybe in the fall yappy's got a thing she's got to do so we got to travel maybe it's not confirmed yet buzzard days is coming in august so if you've not if, if you haven't booked your reservation for cleburne state park it's probably gonna be booked up but you can use a tool like camp nab and ping it and if somebody cancels you can get a site I'll put a link to Camp Nab in the description below. So the homestead, if you've been following the channel, uh, you'll be seeing a video on the new RV pad and the, the, the things that we did there. We've, I've just finished with that. As you can see, we're in a, in a different location now. And if you're interested about building RV pads and that kind of stuff, go over to the RV Homestead Texas channel. The RV Homestead Texas. Yeah, that's all. <laughs> it's hard to pick a channel name on YouTube. Anyway, we're done with this edition of Friday's Finds. Thank you so much for following along. I'd be honored if you've not already, I'd be honored if you'd consider clicking on the subscribe button. That really helps tell the algorithm to propagate the videos. For those of you who have been following along, thank you so much. I sure appreciate your support. And for our patrons, we are so grateful for your generosity. You guys rock. All right, y'all come back now, you hear?